Uh, Grandpa, why do we celebrate the 4th of July? Well, that's when our forefathers declared independence from Great Britain, and the United States of America was born. Oh, why did they declare independence? Well, because the king was a royal pain in our colonial ass, uh, taxing us without giving us representation, quartering soldiers in our houses, sodomizing our livestock, you name it. He really needed a good hard kick in the nuts, and we had just the guy to give it to him. Well, who was that? George Washington. Uh, tell me about him. Uh, sure, kid. Sit back and let me tell you a story. Oh, boy. It all started when a group of grown men decided to have a tea party. Excuse me, uh, can you tell us where we can find some hot bitches? Uh, who are you? I'm Nadolf the Hung, and this is Frito. Uh, who the fuck are you? I am uh, a Chief Red Bull. This is John Deere and old Milwaukee. Uh, we're Indians. You're not Indians. He had just painted your faces. Well, that's not cool. Uh, what's that you're doing with the tea? Uh, we're dumping it in the harbor. Why? Because fuck tea. Shut up. It's because King George has committed intolerable acts upon us. What kind of acts? Oh, intolerable acts. Uh, it means they can't be tolerated. We're dumping all his tea in the harbor. When he wakes up in the morning with no tea, he's gonna be wicked pissed. Uh, this is stupid. Let's go find a bar. Uh, bartender, uh, bring me a bottle of whiskey and a Capri Sun for the kid. You got it. The British are coming. The British are coming. Yeah. Huh? Uh, what? Uh, what the fuck is that guy's problem? I think there's something going on outside. It's seven in the morning. You two need to get out of my bar. Look. Uh, what the hell is that? You ungrateful colonials, where the fuck is my tea? Give me liberty or give me death. I'll give you this. How about that? Prepare to witness what happens when you fuck with the king's tea. Oh, hell no. Will Smith? You ready to take this motherfucker down? We ride together, we die together. Bad boys for life. <laughs> Minutemen, fire at will. Oh, hell no. No, not that, Will. God damn it. Ah, you'll never catch me. He's a wily one. We're going to need help with this. Uh, we'll help. Ah, we're going to need more than a midget and a wizard to defeat King George. I've got some connections in France. Mm, merci, je m'appelle. Oh, not the French. Send in the French. Bonjour. Et croissant, parlez-vous? C'est magnifique. <laughs> King George landed across the Delaware River. How are we going to get to him? Yeah, leave that to me. A boat. Paddle harder, you butter-blooded Nancys. If King George makes it to his stockpile of crumpets, he'll be nigh unstoppable. There he is! Oh no! He's eating his crumpets! Hold it right there, George. We have you surrounded. Oh no! Please don't fire until you see the whites of my ass. <laughs> you son of a bitch. <sighs> Yeesh! Right in the spotted dick. <laughs> Silly colonial. Everybody knows Englishmen don't have testicles. Is that why you're such a prick? Shut up! There's only room in these colonies for one, George. Ugh. No! And now I shall commit my most intolerable act yet. From now on, I decree that every colonial must be interested in soccer. <laughs> That's going too far. He must be stopped. But, but, but what can we do? George Washington is dead. There is one force even more powerful than death itself. It's the foundation upon which this great nation shall be built upon. A freedom? No. God? What? No. Oh, then what is it? Cold and refreshing Bud Light. Look, 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 look. Ah, where is he? He went that way. Uh, do you want me to summon a helicopter? There is no need for that. 
Freedom! <laughs> wow. George. Oh, shit. Fuck you. <gasps> oh. Nice work, George. Thanks for all the freedom. Uh, where are you gonna go from here? To Mount Vernon. Uh, who's Vernon? My wig stylist. What a guy. Come on, Frito. Let's see if we can't mount some of Ben Franklin's French babes.